take to this response. Uh, first of all, I would like all of you uh, uh, who have come here, thank you for joining us. Uh, we are very excited to announce the new initiatives under the HLSR5 Squash Coaching Program. Uh, I would also like to thank our partners, uh, Squash Practice Federation of India, Mr. Cyrus Motra and uh, Mr. Harish Prasad, who are there with us. And also all the, all the player, players who have come in today, uh, uh, from the camp, which is right now ongoing. So thank you, thank you, Joshua, thank you, Saurav, thank you, everyone for coming to join us. Uh, before we begin, uh, I would like to uh, mention a few things about why HCL uh, has invested into sports and, uh, of course, squash specifically. Uh, I think uh, probably everyone knows that you know, HCL is a, is, a, is a technology company. Uh, we were founded in 1976, about 45 years, 46 years back. Uh, and uh, beyond technology, uh, uh, you know, you also thought that uh, we would like to invest in areas which are uh, touching a lot of people, touching a lot of lives, uh, trying to impact them and all of that. Uh, and this is where we thought that you know, sports as a, as, a, as a category, as an area, uh, would, would be suited to us. Uh, under sports, uh, uh, we have invested into squash. Uh, we also uh, do a lot of activities around bridge, which is a, which is a card game. Uh, we have tennis. We also support uh, other sports through Olympic Gold Quest, which is a not-for-profit or uh, organization uh, supporting Olympic uh, or rather preparing athletes for Olympic and other 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 uh, similar kind of tournaments. Uh, but overall, our our brand philosophy is about multiplying human potential, right? And this translates into uh, sports specifically where uh, we think that, you know, rather our objective is to multiply potential of athletes. Go leaps and bounds. Uh, Ten years ago, it was a dream to have, to have players who are ranked top 10 in the world. Uh, we have been fortunate enough to have three of our Indians to reach that reach absolutely the pinnacle uh, in in the PSA rankings. Apart from that, we also recently won the World Doubles Championship, so that's something which has been amazing for us. Now all of this, uh, you know, goes in with a lot of training for the players and they have done their part. Uh, at the back end, uh, the Federation supports them uh, as and when possible. Uh, Sports Authority of India, Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sport has given us also a lot of support over the last few years, uh, over the last two decades. And since 2019, it's been HCL who has been there to support us. Their support has been absolutely fabulous and it's been great working with Rajat and his complete team. Uh, you know, whenever we have any support which is required, it's, it's literally a phone call away where we uh, call him up and say we really need the support and we try and see what is best uh, that can happen. And that's, you know, transcended into these last uh, six years where Indian squash has certainly benefited. I keep saying to everyone and as their motto to touch lives, they truly touch the lives of a lot of our Indian players. Uh, I'll go through a few aspects where, where it's been done and you know we realize that's what's been happening. So initially before the uh, squash podium program, it was the national championships and uh, you know it was uh, with, with Rajat and his team at HCL, we made sure that we got equal prize money for women. Initially, Deepika was the one who also spoke about it and thanks to HCL and their support, we got uh, equal prize money and not only in the seniors, it is being done in the juniors right now. So as we speak, there is equal prize money across all levels in at SRFI events. Uh, so uh, after that, we then started doing junior international events. Uh, the key was we started with Asian junior ranking events, international events, where our juniors got Asian squash ranking points. And that has helped as well when we go and play Asian events that our juniors are ranked. So having, bringing in foreigners 
uh, young boys and girls is always good when we have our events. So that's been another boom. Organizing PSA events at present, we've been the highest PSA event is a $20,000 PSA event where we've done a few. Uh, we've been doing otherwise generally uh, 6,000 and 12,000 challenger tour events. And that's been great. Uh, we had 26 players ranked, uh, you know, five years ago in, in the PSA. Today we've got over 75, and that's going to grow. 